a rocket. And who, may I ask, are you? Never mind, we don't have time for idle chit chat, because it's time to play Psycho Man! Whoa, what's up with that? Okay, here's how Psycho Math works. I'll show you an equation, but instead of numbers, I will show you some pictures. Now listen up. You figure out what numbers the pictures stand for and solve the problem. It's as easy as pie and even more delicious. Ready? Let's get with it. Okay, let's start with the number of the day that New Year's Eve falls on. Then add it to the number of spaces in a tic-tac-toe game. Then divide it by the number of notes in a musical scale. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. You got the answer? You take 30 words the day New Year's Eve falls on, add it to the nine spaces in a tic-tac-toe game, divided by the eight notes on a musical scale, and the answer is five. One, two, three, four, five. Now you're doing psycho math rocket style. Now, get ready for the next one. The number of holes in a standard golf course. Next, add the number of the IQ of a rock. Here's a hint, it's not too smart. Then, take away the number of lives two cats have. How you doing? Did you figure it all out? So, what does it equal? We got 18 holes in the golf course, plus zero IQ points for that dumb old rock, minus 18 lives, that's two times nine of the two cats. And it equals zero. Z-E-R-O zero. And you thought one was a lonely number. Okay, this is the last one. But who's counting? Me, that's who. The number of dollars in a grand. Then you subtract the number of years in five centuries. Minus the number of centimeters in a meter. You got the answer? I know you do. Let's do the psycho math. There are $1,000 in a grand. Minus 500 years in five centuries. Minus 100 centimeters in a meter. Equals 400. I said 400. Okay, I can't take it no more. Professor Rocket has to lie down and rest his aching brain so he can be ready to kick it with more psycho math. Until then, Professor Rocket's out.